Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be doing a kind of cool video. I'm going to take a compound bow, Matthews Traverse, versus a 22 bolt action. This is a Ruger American. And to make this a little more fair, so the basic idea of the test is I'm going to shoot at 50, 100, and uh, if I can, 150 and 200 with both with no magnification and just see which one is more accurate test has nothing to do with power or ballistics or anything like that and uh yeah hope you like it all right so i'm gonna be starting with a 22 i'll be shooting freehand because the bow is freehand and uh you can see the target right around here and uh yeah so i'll measure the groups with each of them and see which one does better i'm shooting uh just some pretty cheap 36 grain federal hollow points i'd like to do some 40 grain target rounds but i don't have any at the moment maybe in a different video so yeah, we'll get started. All right, so now for the bow, Let's see what we can do. So I'm walking up in my groups now, both felt good. <clears throat> so let's check them out. So here's with the bow. And uh, keep in mind, I shot this earlier just to make sure everything was still good and I was sighted in, so there's holes in each target. But here's group, I'll measure in a second here. Um, that's 50 yards. <clears throat> and then with the 22, uh, these are all crossed off because those were shots at long range earlier. And then <clears throat> that would have been a real nice three shot group, but that one was from earlier as well. So there is two, and then we had this one. So I'll measure these up and then get back to you. The bow, I got one and three quarters inch, and the gun was one and seven eighths, 22. So, super close. Um, let's see what they do with 100. All right, so now we're at 100. It's way down there. So I expect the groups to really start spacing out. So, see what happens. We'll send some down range. Now for the bow. bow looks really good 22 not so much so here's my three shots the bow it's like a handy comparison so that was really good um and then the 22 did not go so well so we got one here one here one here so i'll measure those up and then get back to you all right so we're at 150 right now uh i don't know where either of them are gonna hit what the tra trajectory is like so uh, I'm gonna test that up and then get a couple groups down range and see how they look. All right, so there's the targets way out there. And uh, so I'll shoot some 22 rounds and see how they look. All right, so I'm walking up to the 150 yard targets right now. Ended up missing most at first. It took me probably about five or six shots to get, to find the trajectory of each thing. And then I shot three in a row and uh, here's the result. Here's our bow. Um, the group looks like about a foot. I gotta measure them out. But uh, here's my hand compared. And then uh, here's the 22. Shot here, here, and here. So both did pretty well, considering it's 150 yards. And uh, so I'll get these measured up in a sec. So the bow ended up getting 12 inches, pretty much exactly, and the 22 got 10 and a half. So of course this is all due to human error. You know, other people could shoot much better. Um, but I just thought it'd be a fun video to shoot. I ended up not being able to get 200 yards because it got real windy out and it just it was getting too difficult to shoot accurately. So. Hope you guys enjoyed and uh if you have anything any other video ideas put them in the comment section uh please like subscribe and share thanks for watching